So we're heading into day two oh. of our November group. Great group of women. <coughs> Needless to say, the women are fabulous. As they always are. Oh. But it's a big group, so it's 15. And what's amazing to me is when we do general show and tell with 15 women, it well, takes a lot longer. It's really dedicated pussy time. <laughs> it's, I never tire of it. And that's what we, everyone was remarking on your, on your sincere interest and excitement doing something you've done forever. Yes. It never gets boring, it never gets tiresome, it never gets old. It's forever fresh and yes. fascinating. And each woman's <laughs> vulva is different and unique in a little way, it's a little subtlety. Phenomenal, you know, there's a tremendous difference. So different races and ages and Colors, all over the world. Sizes of clits. And it's interesting to see their faces change when we sit down for the final share. Yeah. And they're all like, God, I'm so grateful. It was so easy. It seems so normal. Yeah, it is. It is a, it's a phenomenon. It is. And I wish that every woman could have this experience. Every young woman oh. save you so much time and turmoil oh. so oh. now we're heading into day two and I wanted to answer a question we got which ties in because now we're going to show the women how to stimulate themselves and especially how to penetrate their vaginas the right way so that they have a lot of pleasure and it's all about claiming your sex organ if there was a theme to body sex so this young woman wrote in and she said I have this block penetrating my own vagina I just can't do it. Yeah, it'll be like saying I can't put my... Uh, uh, uh. I can't blow my nose. Oh. I, but can't, there, I can't scratch my ear. <laughs> but there is shame, and there is a cultural prohibition to young women freely penetrating themselves. <laughs> so what is your advice, Dr. Dodson? <laughs> <laughs> you should definitely fuck yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you never hear a man say, oh, I just can't grab my balls while I'm playing with my penis. Oh, I can't penetrate my anus, and there's a lot of men. Well, that's true. Penetration is difficult. It is. It is, because it's trust. You have to trust yourself yeah. first. Now, I know when I do something to my body that doesn't feel good, but if you're not used to doing things to your genitals, it's going to be a new sensation. Yeah. So you always say, get a light, get a mirror, get some lubricant, look at your sex organ. Yesterday, we were all looking at the vaginal opening. It's not just a hole. Oh, it's this, this complex, complicated. It looks like a rose. It's these layers <laughs> and these folds. And the opening can be different styles. Sometimes you can really see the rose. Sometimes you have to pull it open. But it's not just a hole, it's this beautiful, soft pink, sometimes crimson red. The coloration is always different. Yeah. It, I never tire of it. No, so look at your sex organ first. With a light and a mirror and some lubricant, and then just let your hands explore. Do a massage, uh, just play at the to, hole. You have to make sure it's the, the place, it's private. Oh yeah. yes, lock, yes. The, lock the door, uh, take, Put the phone in the other room. Get rid of your cell phone. I mean, you have to create the time. And the space. Very private. And it's, it's you with yourself. It's what it is. It's really exciting, actually. Yeah, it is. I remember the first time I really, really looked. It was, oh, well, I, you know, I always go to the deformity thing because I was convinced I was genitally deformed, it's so sad. I think every woman has something about her vulva that you think is wrong, Ugh. but there's nothing wrong. They're all beautiful. Look at it, touch it, use lubricant. And then we were talking about how when you finally move from your fingers to an object, that's a big deal. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. And I mean, I think you'll have to also smell and taste. See? And I, <laughs> I remember the d different groups when I had all the women put their fingers inside their vaginas and then I now bring it out and smell, smell it. Yeah. And some of them would go, mm. they gagged. 
if you want to have really great orgasms, <laughs> you're going to have to work through that. Yep. You're going to have to be able to appreciate how you smell and how mm -hmm. you taste. It's just like checking your armpit. Yeah. Checking your breath. Well, one of the women said that. She said, you know, I've looked at every part of my body, but I've never looked at my vulva. And I'm sad that for us, we're just like, oh, yeah, my vulva, I know what mine looks like. <laughs> like, do, are we still going to be doing this genital show and tell a thousand years from now because women are still so divorced from their bodies? Yeah. So what you're looking to do is really marry your vulva and your vagina. <laughs> you know? Well, at least start going with it. <laughs> <laughs> at least start dating. <laughs> and it's just go slow, feel the sensations, don't judge yourself. Well, you can judge yourself as perfect and beautiful and special and just give yourself all kinds of compliments. Really. And that's your power. I mean, really, your vulva and your vagina, that is your power. It's the essence of being a woman. That's what all of the men are interested in. That's what in. the whole world revolves around, that tunnel. <laughs> Everyone wants that tunnel. Well, for birth, <laughs> for sex. <laughs> you know? Don't forget the clitoris. Yeah, yeah. That cute little, well, that's not so little. No, and if you're stimulating a clitoris while you're doing penetration, that will also really help because you want to feel pleasure. And even pleasure yeah. can be unfamiliar feeling, but just... Breathe through it, feel the sensations. Oh, pleasure can be very frightening. Uh -huh. it, who was it, Reich, that said pleasure anxiety? He, of course, because it's un, most of us like, never experience pleasure. What is this feeling? Oh, it's, it's, I've never felt this before. This is pleasure. <laughs> and it's going to take a little bit of time yeah. to get to know yourself. So as we head into day two, where we are going to penetrate our vaginas <laughs> in solidarity with you, and masturbate to orgasm. Yes. And I get to come. <laughs> <laughs> I get to come too, next to her. <laughs> I mean, we're hardworking teachers, but, <laughs> but we always have our orgasms. Yes. And the room is having an orgasm. It is. Sisterhood and womankind is having an orgasm. Let's go do it. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs>